Right now on the Crop 4 Morning News, Alameda County Transit officials are cracking down on illegally parked vehicles along its bus routes, and they're using AI cameras to do it. Plus, Oakland Mayor Sheng Tao is launching a new campaign urging voters to reject the recall effort against her when they head to the polls in November. And San Francisco's Fleet Week is officially here. We're live this morning with what you can expect throughout the city. Now, live from the Bay Area's local news station, this is Cron 4 News at 6. Good morning. Thank you for joining us. I'm James Fletcher. And one and we're trying to wade through the heat. Yeah. yeah, hopefully though this is the final really triple digit day that we're going to have to get through. We got John with the forecast. Hey John. Yeah, looking forward to a break. break from this heat at this point we are um, looking at a day tomorrow that is going to drop to the 90s 80s at the warmest after that sounds pretty nice compared to where we've been let's start with a look outside at the golden gate bridge skies are really clear out there with such crystal clear conditions we've had scorching hot temperatures in some cases all the way to the coastline yesterday was a record breaker for spots like san francisco getting up to 97 degrees oakland getting up to 100 yesterday that means today, even though it's still going to be warm, is not going to be quite as hot already. Still warm enough for heat advisories for the vast majority of the Bay Area. to be 90s to triple digits. Tonight, we'll start to feel a sea breeze kicking back in, and tomorrow, we'll really notice the difference. That ahead in your full forecast. Raina? All right, John, thank you. Let's get the news out there. Take a look at your morning commute. Traveling into the city right now, about 17 minutes on the Bay Bridge. Traffic's a little slow and go out there. Uh, but looking good on the San Mateo. No major issues or delays. Look at that, 13 minutes. While you're Richmond Summer Fell Bridge, around 8. And the Golden Gate, 37 of the tolls. You're looking at a 20-minute drive on this Monday morning. All right, at 601, let's get to our big story happening today because around the Bay Area, faith leaders are going to be hosting events to remember the lives lost in Israel and Gaza since Hamas led a surprise attack on Israel back on October 7th of last year. Yeah, and Lafayette Sunday, hundreds of people gathered to remember those victims. Cromverse Jack Molman has that story. Well, a reminder to stay up to date on all your local news, weather and sports by streaming Cron, on, Cron 4 News on your TV for free with the Cron On app. It's also available for download on Apple TV, Roku, Fire TV, and Samsung TVs. You can also on 4 News on your TV for free with the Cron On app. It's also available for download on Apple TV, Roku, Fire TV, and Samsung TVs. You can also stream Cron 4 News on the go wherever you are with the Cron 4 mobile app. Or you can watch us online as well on our website at cron4.com. It's 6.56. We're going to take a break here. But coming up in the next hour of the Cron 4 Morning News, Fleet Week is back. We'll tell you what spectators can expect. The latest craze to make you look younger. I feel great. Wait till you see what these women are applying to their faces. Next, Inside Edition. Tonight at 7, followed by E.T. at 7.30.